What's up? I did not take my makeup off last night, and I'm just gonna build on it today. Ugh. Good morning. Good morning. I've been up since six again. I don't know what's going on with me, but six o'clock is ridiculous. If you guys have ever watched any of my lives, you know I don't do six. No. Ugh. Sorry. Good morning. Good morning. Happy days. I gotta make this kind of quick because my friend is coming over to grab me and we're gonna go um, get breakfast and then maybe go do paint if there's not a bunch of people in there. Where's that an outside thing? Hi, Marty. Hi, Ferdinand. I'm going over whatever's on my face already because I'm just not taking it off. I just don't want to. <laughs> Hi, Mary. It's Saturday. So we're going to go, um, Kara, what's up? Um, we're going to go to a place called, which I really probably should have looked up the menu. I think that's where we're going to go to a place called Toast. Never been there. No, I'm not going to eat bread. I'm sure they have something. What did I say? Didn't I say it's Saturday? What did I say? Oh, I probably said it like Friday or something. Probably did. I probably said a whole nother day. <laughs> good morning, good morning. So we're just gonna go over what's already on our face because I don't want to make time to take it off. Ugh, ugh. Thanks, Mary. Hello. I really need to get this hair did, but I just can't do it right now with my hair still falling out. So if it's not hot, I wear wigs if it's hot. Oh, <laughs> I was like, I probably said a different day. It is early. I've been up since six, six o'clock. I mean, what is going on with my world? I mean, really, what's going on with my world? really good um I end up having a uh Philly cheesesteak with um I just had him not put the bread on nope put it to chop uh, not put it on bread and um they it was had peppers in it and banana peppers in it onions it was really good very good actually so thanks for asking it was it was really nice we got to catch up um it's the same person I'm going out with today um hi Amber um and we're gonna go and we gotta pick up our paint and pour, or paint and pour. That's wrong. We did some a ceramic. She does uh, mushrooms to put out in her garden, and I did an owl, and it's gonna go in my bathroom upstairs, and they are done. So that's where we're gonna go pick those up. And I was like, being lazy, laying in my bed, and I was like, you wanna get breakfast? She's like, I need about an hour, and I'm like, that's perfect because that gives me time to do whatever I need to do. So. But we try to go places that you can sit outside. I gotta get my mask out of my, you know, it's like, it's like now with the mask, it's like, I gotta get my mask. It's like, I gotta grab my keys. It's like, I gotta grab my purse. It's just another thing now. So, I mean, I have some in my purse, but there's one of them that I wanna wear cause it's blue and I have blue. Like I have in my, I'm wearing leggings today. Um, cause my shorts were still wet and I only have one pair of shorts. And you're like, why do you only have one pair of shorts? Cause I had three pairs, but two of them don't fit, and I went to take them back to Walmart. Well, they're not taking clothes back. I'm like, okay, whatever. I, whatever you guys, whatever, whatever your policy is, I will abide by it. And then a girl messaged me last night. And she's like, can you add me to the playgroup? And I read it as, can I add you to a playgroup? And I wrote her back and I said, so I misread it and I was like, you can add me to a play group. I'm just going to tell you my kids are older. And then I reread it today and I was like, I wrote her and I was like, oh my God, I so read that wrong. So read that wrong. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> cause I'm her key spouse. So she was asking me about some stuff and I was like, I wrote her back today and I was like, I totally read that wrong. I'm really sorry. Totally read that wrong. 
So, yeah. It's okay to be a wackadoo. It's okay. It's all right. Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> I mean, I'm crazy. I don't know about these brows today, but they're just going to have to do, I think. I'm putting a hat on, so you're barely going to see them anyway. You're barely going to see them anyway. It's all good. What's up? What are you guys doing? It's Saturday. I know. It's freaking early. It's like, really? I'm just wrong with you. Ugh. Especially six. I got up at six yesterday. I got up at six again today. I mean, I usually do get up around like six or seven. I let the dogs out. Then I go back to sleep. That's what I do. And guess what? I couldn't go back to sleep today. I was like, seriously? How am I going to do it with the... Like, I got problems. I told you I slept in this stuff, and it still looks not too bad. This could probably blend a little, you whack job. <laughs> oh, I'm a hot mess today. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm totally rocking it, Julia. Hell to the no. I can't, I'm not getting it dyed right now. Like, my girl even said she'd come to my house. But I'm like, let's just wait till it stops falling out. I mean, I'm half tempted to go get a Sally's thing and just pop it on here. But I don't want to jack up anything. And I don't, I don't know. A unibrow? You're a whack job. <laughs> Everyone meet Julia. She's my crazy friend. I love her though. I do. I do. Okay. I'm like making. I think you should go all gray. Yeah. No. Well, you never know. By the time fall time gets here and bad things happen again, God forbid it does not. But if it does, I may end up going all gray. I mean, we're already about, what, an inch and a half in? I think. Probably. Something like that. Mm -hmm. Dang it, that lip gloss is in my purse. Hmm. What to do? Erin. I need to find a hair tie. You know when you don't want something, there's a thousand of them. When you need something, there's not to be around. How are you? I gotta get a hair tie. Oh, I think that was, yeah, we'll just wear this one. Ugh. You're going gray? I don't know. Why can't you go gray from like the ends up? <laughs> you know, ugh. I would not mind it then. It's going gray from the root out. It's like, ugh. Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I haven't decided. I'm going to have plenty of wigs. It's just so hot right now to wear them. Morning, Angie. So, I'm rocking this today. It's the new thing, you promise? If Grandma was alive, I'd have to ask her. Is Aaron joshing me? <laughs> Hi, Brianna. Like, is Aaron joshing me, Grandma? She telling me it's the new, it's the thing, and it's not the thing. <laughs> oh heavens! I just put a hat on. Yesterday I wore a Myrtle Beach hat. Today I'm gonna wear my, I'm gonna rock my unique black hat. Man, it's only 9.30. I have painted my toes because they were horrible. And I've done my makeup now, which is not a whole lot. And then I got to finish taking my vitamins. I've decided I can't take them all at one time. There's just too many of them. It's a hot mess. 
These look a little crazy, but they'll be fine, right? It'll be fine. Yeah, it's always fine. Grandma would say yes. I don't know. <laughs> oh. This hair, I'm telling you. Shoosh. And it's like so thin now. It's like, how did I, how, I, people that have thin hair, my heart goes out to you. I have never, I've been blessed to never have thin hair. Always had thick hair and had a lot of it. So losing it and getting it thinned, I don't know how anybody, I don't, I don't know how you do it. Like you keep seeing me put it through this little ponytail holder because it keeps coming out. Thanks, Angie. Ugh, I'm tired. I could go back to bed. <laughs> but you know what I would do? I would, why do I keep doing that? I would lay there and not sleep. Like I did this morning anyway. Hi, Devon. Hi, oh, Elizabeth. All right, so I'm gonna go finish. I had a hair tie on my wrist. Are you serious? I want, I went to Cracker Barrel 80% off. Girl, I was like granny. 80% <laughs> off at Cracker Barrel? Is that all Cracker Barrels? Because I need to go. What's 80% off? What What is all the stuff and the, and the, and the things? Hi, Chriselle. Oh. Oh. I love me some Cracker Barrel. May have it somewhere. See, it's like, I want to sit outside. It is hot here, but I'd rather sit outside than inside because people are, mm -hmm. and uh, it was weird because yesterday was the first time I'd actually went into like a restaurant and every other booth you could not sit in. And I was just like, so weird. And then um, I asked my friend, I was like, if you want to sit in here, we can. She's like, no. No, because I don't do that. I get up. Oh, well, yeah, it's, I'm leaving here in about 30 minutes. So. <laughs> I may have to tell tell Nancy we need to go to Cracker Barrel today. Like, girl, 80% off. Watch it only be the, the Shelbyville one, the Indiana one. Grandma would have been in heaven, man. She's probably up in heaven going, I'm missing the sale. <laughs> Yeah, Brenna, if I did, like, usually when I let the dogs out, I go back to sleep. And then when I get up and get moving and doing my thing and my stuff, then I do my live. It's since I've been getting up in the mornings. And then, um, like, yesterday I had stuff to do. And today I have stuff to do. So, it is, a, it is a downer. I have to agree with you. So, we have to make the best out of it. And, like, yesterday, there's this new, um, like... We have this like little strip mall that's actually, it's really nice. So where we went, it's not a strip, I guess that, I don't know what you call them. Uh, to get some great shampoo and conditioner I get from Amazon. It's great for thinning, thinning, thinning. Come on, helps with hormonal changes. Okay, that'd be awesome. I should go back to normal soon. It should start getting better. So I'm getting baby hairs and stuff like that. So it's just gonna take time. But yeah, that's cool. Um, what was I saying? I don't remember now. Yeah, whatever. Oh, so we went, it's called Still City, and it's like a pizza place, um, stuff like that. And they have this new liquor store, and we just went in just to look. And, um, she put her mask on, and I was like, we are the only two in here, okay? He is behind plexiglass, and I'm going to not wear my mask today. <laughs> I will wear it. I mean, I wear it a lot. Um, but whenever like, I go into some place, if there's nobody in there and it's just me and a plexi, a person behind plexi guys, yeah. I think it was created by the world's leaders so they can exercise their power to dictate. Well, maybe. Hi, Karen. Everyone was Cracker Barrel crazy. She was. She was Cracker Barrel crazy. She also worked there like part-time back in the time and um like I don't know how long ago 
but then she got really sick. But um, she got a discount. Um, Twilight Zone for real. Oh, I am so, we're doing that. I'm going to be like, Nancy, we're going to the Cracker Barrel today, friend. Um, she did. She, it was, she got a discount. And then if we went, um, she would give us her discount. She's like, I'm pretty sure that I work here for you all to get a discount. I was like, what? No, you work here because you like it. <laughs> I'm going to have to go. Thanks for telling me, Erin. That's my cousin, guys. She lives in um, Indiana. In good old Westport. Isn't that right? Yeah, I think that's right. <laughs> oh, heavens to Betsy. Why am I getting a headache? Who knows? Who knows? So, all right, I'm going to pop off here, um, and I will probably see you guys later. All right? Have a great Saturday, guys. It's nice outside. Get outside. Get some sun. It makes you feel better. Get the vitamin D, because a lot of us are vitamin D deficient because we don't go outside a whole lot or get sunlight. Um, yeah, I did. It so did. Erin is so right. Everything you knew. Something cool from Cracker Barrel, and that's what you were getting. It was awesome. She was an amazing woman. I just hope one day I can be as awesome as she was. Because she is. She was an amazing woman. She always, she was a hairdresser for, I don't know, since birth probably. And she just was, she was fantastic. So, and we can all strive to be as amazing as she was. Like she was, she was not, she was a beautician. She was, she did all kinds of stuff. She was amazing. Besides being an amazing grandma. What? So... But, all right, guys, I'm going to go. I love you. I love you, Erin. I love you guys, and I will see you all later. Bye.